Hi and welcome to Crumbs from Jarad. The theme for today's Bible reflection is Love Cast Out Fear. The reading is from Matthew chapter 10 verses 26 to 31. I read one verse. Do not fear those who kill the body but cannot kill the soul. Rather fear him who can destroy both soul and body in hell. Fear is supposed to be one of the most powerful emotions, more powerful than hatred and anger. Today's short reading, three times Jesus speaks of having no fear. What are the two things that we are afraid of in this reading that he speaks of? One is people maligning our name, spoiling our name. He says, don't fear them because they don't know the full truth. You must reveal that truth to them. So that's the first thing he says, don't fear it. They call Jesus himself the king of devils, but he was not bothered about it. The second thing he says not to fear about is death. Those who can kill the body. Not that we shouldn't take care of our bodies. That over concern that we have for our life, sometimes that because of that, we don't even live. So Jesus says, have no fear. Why not to have fear? There's one very important reason. And that one reason is because you are loved by the Father in heaven. And he give us, gives us two illustrations. He says, if your Father in heaven cares for those sparrows that cost next to nothing and he takes care of them, how much more value are you? And the second is, He's so concerned about you that he knows every hair that you have on your head. He has counted them. Incidentally, there are supposed to be one lakh hair on our head. Of course, I am not the best illustration for that. But God is concerned. So whatever is happening in your life, he's aware. And he wants the best for you. And he will work the best for you if you allow him to. In the Bible, in the book of Psalms, 127 times we have the word, the steadfast love of the Lord. God has a faithful love for us. He will never disappoint us. And so for your minute meditation, I suggest you listen to this hymn put up over here, Be Not Afraid. Lord, open my heart during this minute meditation.